in America, they would never give me and that look like me a job because they know that men like me have fixed things. Native American, black people with royalty DNA, real Native Americans and slaves from Mississippi, Alabama, and Tennessee. All in my DNA. I'm related to Georgia too. And it's probably the best part of Georgia DNA. So, it never make sure that somebody like me get the power to fix things for the future of black people. Native Americans or black people with royalty DNA. Right? So, uh, they know that women, they, they friends with single mothers, uh, divorced women, or widows, or women that had children and the men died. Then you got older men that mess it up because they education or they DNA. Uh, when it come to black men, if you was a drug dealer, I can't follow you. If you was a pimp, I can't follow you. So, uh, if Ohio is the underground railroad, why would I pimp the women? If Ohio is the underground railroad, why would I sell drugs? If my DNA is so important, why would I follow anybody from any other state? Uh, then you got men that don't look like me. Then you got men that do look like me. Then you got the police. Then you got doctors. Then you got, uh, what else? The mental health system. So yeah, I gotta put up with all that. And if I have children and I have a son, they gotta put up with all that. Then if I have a daughter, y'all gonna teach them the way that y'all wanna teach her. So since my DNA is so important, I gotta be alive to teach them why our DNA is so important. So I can't go to the military and miss my child's life. I can't go to work and miss my child's life. Uh, I can't go to college or prison and miss my child's life. So, if you want to be a single mother or a mother that control everything, and I got to be there, I can't be a part of that. So, the police and the doctors, they attack men that look like me every day because those men don't have my DNA and they won't ever have my DNA and it's important.